Hey, what's up guys? Thanks is Alfie here. Today I'm going to be trying something a bit new. Um, if you've played Hearthstone before, you may know of the Arena mode, which is sort of like a draft mode when you go to um, reveal like card opening pack things at uh, comic shops or whatever. Um, so basically, we are going to generate six random Pokemon, we're going to choose one of them, and then we can uh, pick one out of the six, and we'll do this six times. So it's basically sort of like drafting, and I figure I'd do this from Ari, and this is an idea from based off Blame Truth, who did this a very, very long time ago, but I remember watching it, it was really cool. So as soon as we get through losses, we're done for. And the goal of this is to see how far we can go. So first, that just are you <laughs> okay? <laughs> I saw the Guzzlord and the Rhydon. I'm like, um, what are we playing? And by the way, I'm not taking these sets. I may have sets set to viable, but I am not playing with an assault vest Gardevoir. All right. Um, but anyways, who do we want? Like, my Lonic is a really, really nice pick. But I have some favoritism towards Tyrantrum. You know what? I'm just gonna pick my Lonic. Uh, you can do this sets later. I'll just go ahead and get this done. And then, um, I'll also get one reshuffle if I need to. So, I'll go with my Lonic because it's like one of the best mods in the tier. Uh, the next mod we will get is. Uh. So these are really, really great picks, especially since these two have overlapping typings. Oliver isn't too good. Hoopa, I, I think people like Hoopa. I just don't care for it. Galvantula is kind of a weird place, especially with um, Mega Steelix around. So I think I can just go Cresselia. You know, get some of that really bulky offense. And, you know what, screw Dory, it's not here anymore. Although it never really ran X scissors, so I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, boy. So, let me just get this straight. Aggregus, Typhlosion, and Clean Clay are all trash, don't use them, the wear is kinda cool. But, with my current core right now, I really, really, really want either Mega Steelix or Dewblade. But, my problem is choosing only one of them. You see, it's really tough because if I go with Mega Steelix, then I have a guaranteed. Um, no, I'm gonna go with Mega Steelix just because I have Cresselia to help check a Goro if I need to, or like you know, fighting types in general. Dublin doesn't even check that, and you know what? Mega Steelix still checks up, um, oh, dude. Yeah, there's like almost no reason to not go with uh, Mega Steelix right here. Um, this is turning out to be like a really standard team. But you know what? It's fine. I can deal with that. Um, what is next? Next pick is... Uh, Escav, Florges, Strapion, Ruxious, Mega Camera, and Bronze on. Um, you know, none of these are really good, and I don't really have a sweeper on the team, so I could go with Drapion. Drapion just seems like the wor the, not the worst one here, although I could go Florges, but that makes my team like super, super slow, and I want to have some type of offensive presence, even if it's like Swordsman, Swarium, Z, Drapion, which is very good. I may use my reroll on Drapion, but I'm not sure. I'm just gonna pick up Drapion now. Uh, just because the other options don't look appealing. Like, I can't, I can't choose Mega Camera. A Scav and Bronzo are not bad picks on their own. But I already have Mega Licks. And. Ruxious doesn't fit the team. And Floor just makes the team too slow. Um, this is fine, I guess. Last two mods, unless we need to reroll. Oh my gosh, the Vaporeon. 
uh, who I even forgot was usable. Uh, Machamp, Jolteon, Registeel, Cantagrius, and Rhyperior. Oh man, how do I even choose between this? Registeel is like a no-go. I have Mega Steelix. Rapier is also pretty much a no-go. Cantagrius doesn't really fit on this team. At all. Jolteon's bad. Machamp doesn't fit on two team. Do I go with Jolteon just to give myself a revenge killer? It also helped me get some damage against my Lonic. I guess I'll go with Jolteon because I don't feel like I have any other option. Oh man. What is next? Torkoal, Mega, Audino, Clowitzer, Hoopa, Explan, and Cloyster. Oh my gosh, these are all awful. Ah. Explode is a cool mod. Hoop is also nice, but kind of makes me really pursuit weak. Um, Mega Audino is not a bad mod. I've actually been meaning to try it um, in the tier because I feel like some sort of bulky combine, like combine wish, um, fire move, and then fairy move maybe could work well in Mega Audino. Because you can just fire blast uh, the Mega Steelix. Oh man, Torkoal? I really don't want to bring the Torkoal. I think I'm just going to go with x -Blood. Like, alright. The last three mods look like if they were in Oros, and then you move back to the left, and then it looks like it's Sun Moon. <sighs> Do I want to re roll anything? Um, here's my rules for rerolling. You can reroll one mod, but you have to pick a new mod. Um, if you do reroll it, so it's not like I can uh, look at another six mods and they're all bad. And it's like, oh, I don't want to use either of them, so I'll just keep told you. Oh, no, that's not how it works. Oh man, I can run with this. This is fine, I guess. All right. Let's just go ahead. Uh, leftovers. Actually, I could just steal the analysis set. The old like spread was like for variant, and that's not really. Um, that's well, that's gone now. So we don't need to run as much physical defense as we used to. Um, some Thunderbolt bolts. Um, what else would I need? Maybe I could run sub pass, but nope. If it smoke, why would you have to ban my baton pass? Uh. What else do I want? Power ice. Do I really want hidden power ice? I feel like if I want anything, um, I definitely want shadow ball. And I guess I want Hidden Power Ice. The reason I want Shadow Ball is because it'll do more damage than anything to, um... Because I can bring Signal Beam? Um... For what, Serena? Yeah, probably just like Serena. And, you know what, that's fine and all. I'd rather have Shadow Ball. Um... That way I can hit Megalix or something if I need to. And then Hidden Power Ice is almost obligatory because of Gligar. Um, this works. And then, am I running double specs? I guess I'm running double specs. Uh, but whatever works. I have a small switch in. Okay, yeah. A fire blast. Uh, I'll try to say, people I might have forgotten what covers this one gets. And just switch in their freaking X pods into my. Or uh, switch in their Mega Steeluxes into my X pod. Oh, what else is this run? It doesn't really need anything, does it? Uh, I can't think of anything else that it would need. Maybe Ice Beam. It gets Ice Beam, right? Yeah, 
Yeah, I guess I speed. I speed this for Gligar. And I really don't know. Is there like a way to uh, get rid of my item? Well, yeah, there's Flame. Do I have like Switcheroo? That'd be funny. No trick. Definitely no trick. You're on Endeavor? <laughs> Push the mark? <laughs> it's like, I really don't need anything. And Sleep Powder is it like a prevalent move this gen? I just don't know what to run. This last slot. Um, yeah, I just don't know. I can just run Flame in case if I need to get rid of the item for some reason, like it's just a hindrance. So whatever works, and we're not bulky specs. We're up pretty fast. That was just below. I can just steal it. Oh. Did they update this actually? I have gotten around to update it. I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure. I feel like this part was something else before. Uh, maybe they just updated this part and they did update the analysis? That's entirely possible. Marvel skill. I like competitive a lot. Competitive is nice to have. Um, yeah, we're gonna run Wari and Z. Hey. Arimzi? Um, losing job. <sighs> or I could use Ground DMZ. Oh, Gligar is kind of. Oh. Mega Steelix is more of a problem than Gligar, I think. I'm not sure. I lot kind of beats both of them on its own. Question is, do I want like if I have? What's the point of have? Oh yeah, if I have watery in me, watery, um, I could have a better matchup versus um, Gligar because I could actually hit it then. Um, but if I uh, go groundy, um, then I could do more damage to Mega Steelix. But I think. Any both of those is probably preferred. So I'll keep the Wardy of Wardy of I can't speak for the life of me. Uh, where's Jolly? Here's Jolly. There we go. And that's clear. I need another wing pause. I think I'll do like some sort of sub called mindset. And let me just go ahead and sell this analysis spread. There's one up. But, yeah. So, like, lefties. Sub. Oh my. Midblast. I shock. This should work well. And, I have to make sure my Steelix has. Oh, there's no set yet for you. Shape. We'll just steal this one. Shirt does something for um, you, you. Uh, not much here. And let's just go ahead and change this again because I prefer it like that. Uh, yeah, there's Megalix. Toxic, yeah. They don't even uh, recommend Roar. That's kind of interesting, but whatever. Uh, Cresselia. How much does Pangoro reach? With a jolly, I guess. Or timid, doesn't matter. In my case, uh, two thirty-seven. That's fair. So I can create two thirty-seven. Go ahead, two thirty-eight. You can dump the rest to physical bulk and HP. Um, because I'll be called mighty up anyways. So. This works well. He looks okay. I, I thought we really had something to go with the first part, and then we just start again, like, terrible choices. Oh, man. Um, 
create a number. What? Yeah, that was the prelude video. If you guys want to see the next part, make sure to uh, subscribe, and I'll have it up like the next day or something like that. Hopefully. Um, but yeah, if you guys do enjoy this concept and want to see more of it, uh, make sure to leave a comment telling me what tiers you'd like me to play next. And uh, remember to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. See ya.